Hey y'all, so I've been saying that I'm going to do a video showing you all how to yoni steam step by step for a very long time. And I finally made time for it and I'm just going to hop right on into it. So I'm in my bathroom. This is where the session will be taking place. And as you can see, I have my station, my um, atmosphere already set up. I have everything that I need in here. I have some essential oils diffusing. I have incense burning. And because I'm seven months pregnant, this is just an example, but these are not yoni, like the specific blend that you that I use to um, steam with, but this is going to be for my herbal bath later. So I'm going to be using this as an example, but it's set up the exact same way. I have my self-guided journal to write in. Um, I love this thing. Um, and these are the incense that I'm burning. It creates a really calm environment. I really like these. I got them from Walmart for a dollar. Um, not big on trying look stuff like this, but I really like them. And I have me some ginger tea, so I'll hop right on in. So these are your yoni uh, herbs. Usually when you buy some yoni or herbs, they're going to come with instruction. So all you need is just about a cup. This is about more than a cup because I'm doing a bath with these herbs later. But damn, look y'all. Look, please look. That's it. I know so many women have been intimidated and thinking it's so hard. You see this big silver bowl right here? That's all you need. Right there. This has been steeping. Uh, I mean, the water has been boiling and it has been sitting. You want to make sure that it's not too hot. So, because if it's too hot, it'll destroy the property, um, the healing properties of the herbs. So, it's not too hot. You want to um, let it get to a, a good, you know, hot temperature and then let it sit for about five minutes. And I'm just pouring it in there. Enough to like cover the herbs. I can already smell the aroma of these herbs. Calendula and rosebuds and some lavender infused Epsom salt. So you see that steam coming up? This is the power. That steam is going to go up your yoni. This stuff is melting fibroids, cysts, it's balancing hormones. Melting away like extra tissue in the vaginal lining. I mean, this stuff is good for women of all ages. You want to do a test, meaning you want to kind of squat over it. If it's too hot, if it burn like the lips, get up, wait for it to cool off some more. Once you got it at that good, steady temperature, that's comfortable enough for you to squat, sit over. Just... Hold up. Just pretend you're sitting, sitting on here. Put that towel over your lap so the steam can be trapped in. And there you go. That's how you yoni steam. You know, I do this for about 45 minutes. Um, have my tea. Um, have my music going. Um, I journal so it's very easy like I think every woman needs to be doing this especially if you've been on birth control if you're trying to conceive it's very very helpful um just want to show how the herbs look just a few tips make sure you clean your toilet out I recommend using some natural chemical free products because the steam, um, if you're using like Fabuloso bleach, that steam from the toilet is going to infuse in you too. And that's defeating the purpose. So use something that's very natural. I do sell a natural household cleaner for just $7. It's good to clean your toilet with. Um, and shower before you yawn this thing. Because if you have any yeast, sweat, bacteria, dirt, anything, it's... 
I just think it's going to steam up you. So just take a shower before you go on the steam. Hope this video was helpful. Um, as I always encourage y'all, if y'all have any more, if you have any questions, just please feel free to message me. I'm going to show it one more time. You see the silver bowl? Y'all know the silver mixing bowls? I, I don't know the size. It's crazy. But I simply just set this thing in here. It's not even touching the water. The toilet water. It's not even touching it. Push, put this thing down. Sit down. And you're good. That's all you need. So if you're having any type of anxiety... You feel like overwhelmed about not knowing how to do it. You think it's complicated. It's not. And I just want to show y'all that I actually have the stool. I bought this stool from Etsy, I believe, for 90 bucks. And it's very uncomfortable. Um, it sits very low. And I'm 5'2", and it's still uncomfortable. And it's hard. So I had to put a lot of towels, you know, around the opening for me to sit down to make a cushion. Um... The only thing I liked about the Yoni stool, stool is that I can steam in my me time room. But now that I have a baby on the way, that room is no longer mine. So when he comes, I'll be on that toilet. <laughs> Hope this helps y'all. Have a great day.